Hi, are you aware of the three common problems today? Dehydration, acidosis and inflammation? Well, a lot of the liquids we're consuming on a regular basis can be helping lead to things like low energy, poor sleep, increased pain. And the simplest way that we found to help reduce those is by the water we drink. So what we're going to do is we're going to give you a quick demonstration covering those three properties. If we go over here, we've got the tap water, which we're going to get and fill up this jug. And then we're going to allow the tap water to go through the Enagic Carganate unit. So put that in there. This is Enagic's flagship product. So we'll let this fill up. As you can see, we're doing this live so that you know that we're not cheating you in any way possible. And there we go. So let's just put the lids on those two. So we've got our tap water in the blue one and we've got the kangen water in the nice flowery one. So first of all I'm going to put some tap water in this little cup and I'm going to put it in this one. So the first, water, the first liquid we're going to look at is Miso. Now this is a sports drink so it's used to replenish um, electrolytes lost during exercise. The next, thing, next one we're going to look at is the Gatorade, popular drink among athletes. Oh, we'll put that in there. Okay, and then we're going to look at sparkling spring water. So, just be careful that this doesn't jump out everywhere on me. Okay. Then we're going to look at a, another filtered spring water, okay, and Puro, and put that in there. So we're using different waters just to help you get clarity around a lot of these commonly drank waters and what we're putting in our body. Now coconut water, there's a lot of focus around coconut water at the moment, especially in smoothies. So we'll use this one here, and just fill that up. Okay, all good. Soda water. So a lot of people like this with a bit of vodka and lime at the weekend. So we'll, uh, we'll give this one a quick taste. Okay. And then we've got um, one of the healthiest, healthiest waters on the market. We've got Antipodes, sold in a lot of health cafes, organic restaurants and so on. So we'll put that in there. And then we will do the kangen water. Okay. There we go. Now then, the first property we're going to focus on is the oxidation property. Now this is what's um, basically aging and rusting process. So we've got a meter here that tells us whether a liquid is helping to cause oxidative stress or reduce it. Now if it gives us a positive reading it's causing oxidation, it's causing us to age, to rust. At the moment, it's a positive 300 plus, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stick it in the drinks as we go along so that you can see the difference with what we're looking at. Remember, if this goes into a negative, it's a powerful antioxidant, which is what we want. So first of all, we're going to tap water. So we're climbing here, 450, 460, and we're still going up. So this is causing a lot of that oxidative stress, the aging process. So we go through, we go into the my zone. So this is your sports drink to help replenish after exercise. So we've got 450 slowly coming down, but still a very high oxidant. And if we look at the chart, the oxidative chart here, you can see on the left, on the right hand side, that any, any of those liquids are causing the oxidative stress. So we go into the Gatorade. So now we've got 380 and climbing, so a positive 380. So this is helping to cause uh, the aging process, the rusting of the body. Now we go into the sparkling mineral water. So let's just have a look at that. So we're around about high 400s, 480, 490. So that's causing a lot of oxidative stress. We go into the Puro, so the filtered spring water. 
Um, so we've got a high 400s again. Okay, so we can clearly see that a lot of these liquids already are causing that um, a, the, us to age, basically, the oxidative stress on us. We'll go into the coconut water. So coconut water is coming down a little bit, but it's still very, very high, still in the high 400s. Um, so now we're coming down, oh, we're, we're getting into around about high 300s. We've seen this get round, down to about 280, um, but still causing a lot of that oxidative stress. So just dip it into the water there. We go into the soda water. Uh, 366, 360, so high 300s causing that, um, that aging process. So just give that a rinse off. Then we go into the um, natural spring water from New Zealand, uh, the Antipodes, and you can see it's 400, high 300s. Um, so that's also causing the oxidative stress, the aging process. And all illness and disease originates in a body under oxidative stress, so it's really important to understand that. So then we go into the Kangen water, and what you're noticing here is it's gone into a negative. It's over negative 300 at the moment, um, still climbing negative 320. So you can see that the Kangen water, compared to all the others, is reducing oxidative stress, reducing the aging process, so that we can feel and look younger, um, enjoy our life. So that's a very, very powerful demonstration just to give you clarity around um, the liquids that we're consuming on a regular basis that are helping to cause us to age. In our next video, we were going to cover which liquids are acidic. This is a pH chart. Okay, it ranges from pretty much 2 all the way up to 14. Now, our body wants to be in more of an alkaline state to help reduce the chances of getting illness and disease. And the way that we're going to do this test is with some pH drops, potential hydrogen, within the waters. Now then, if we start here, I'm going to just add some drops to these liquids so that you can see the difference of which ones are acidic and which ones are alkaline. Okay, so if I give this a quick swirl, now what, do you may, what you may be noticing is that a lot of these liquids are yellow, orangey, and that when we look at the chart, we can see that anything on this side of the chart is causing acidic stress within the body. And the common, common symptoms of a body under acidic stress, low energy, poor sleep, joint pain, muscle pain, you know, these skin conditions, a lot of it in this environment. So if we start here at my zone, we can see it's causing a lot of acidic stress, as well as Gatorade. Now, the big thing around these drinks is, is that when we, when we perform exercise, lactic and uric acid is created and our body releases electrolytes, which is basically calcium from the bones, to neutralize any acidity that, that is created in the body or that we consume. Now, when we are performing exercise and our body's working to recover quickly and we come along and we drink anything that's acidic, our body releases more naturally occurring electrolytes to neutralize that acidity. So we're actually increasing acidity throughout the body, which is quite shocking from a health professional's point, which I never knew much around this. When we look then at the spring water, we're over here, very acidic again, um, so causing more of that inflammation within the body. The other spring water, very acidic. Now this one always interests people, the coconut water, very acidic. And this is all packaged coconut water. However, if you get coconut water from a fresh coconut, it's actually neutral. Okay, so something to be aware of whenever we're, uh, when we're making our smoothies and using a lot of coconut water. Soda water, very acidic, okay? And it's no better with your vodka and your lime in it. I can guarantee you that. Your antipodes, also very acidic. So as we're seeing here, we've already shown that these liquids are causing oxidative stress, are causing your body to age, to rust. Now we're seeing that they're causing acidic stress as well. This water is the tap water. Now tap water is federally regulated to always come out neutral to slightly alkaline. 
And the reason for that is, is because the chemicals that they add increase the pH to prevent rusting the pipes through the ground. However, I'm not sure about our own pipes in our body. So tap water will always come out of that colour. The Kangen water, we chose the 9.5 setting, it's high alkaline. It's also high in antioxidants, so it's very good for the body. The difference between this water and alkaline water is that alkaline water has minerals added to it to increase the pH. That creates a chemical change within the water. This water, however, has an electrical change, which helps create electrical and anti and, um, based antioxidants, as well as the byproduct is the alkalinity of it. So these, there's nothing added to the water in any way, so it can't build up in the system. So what I'm going to do now is just show you what happens when we start drinking Kangen water. So if I had a bit of this there, you can see it's clearly turned this drink into a healthy drink. So if I go along and start down here, and I go, um, and I go through, the only thing you're going to start to notice is that the colour starts to fade a little bit. And that's just because if we added more pH drops, it would become brighter again. Trying to change, but wasn't. Coconut water, surely we can get coconut water back. No, unfortunately not. Now soda water. It's trying. Now this one, the Antipodes. Look at that. Did you see that? We'll do it again. It changed, and then it went back. So if we come along as well to the tap water, you know, we can change that into a bit, a bit more healthy. So if I was to come along, and, I, and as normal, have a smoothie, put a bit of coconut water in, into my water or whichever, into my body, Look at how it's just neutralized that and created it to be acidic. So the acidic properties of the coconut water have neutralized the health properties within the Kangen water. This is helping to give people a clearer understanding of how they can help reduce that acidity that's being created in the body on a daily basis so that they can experience improved health. If you want to know more, please contact us around that. Our next video, our third property, is going to be how the body is hydrated far quicker by drinking Kangen water compared to regular water. Thank you. Hi, are you aware that regular water doesn't remove any of the chemicals from your fresh fruits and vegetables? The pesticides, insecticides and herbicides? And when we ingest them, they actually have a negative effect on our body. So what we're going to talk about today is how we can actually reduce that toxic chemical load from within so that you and your family can experience improved health as well as the hydration benefits of this water, how you can achieve optimal hydration to once again experience amazing energy. Well, this is video three, all on microclustering. Now in video one, we covered how to reduce oxidative stress, help reduce the aging process. In video two, we covered how we can reduce acidic stress so we feel more energized. Well, this is video three. So what we're going to do is actually take some of these t fresh tomatoes here and open them up. And the first thing, I'm actually going to put half of them into this bowl here. And then the other half into this bowl. And the reason why I'm doing this is so that you can see that I'm not tricking you in any way with these tomatoes. So let's just put the rest of those in there. And the rest of those in there. Okay. So we've got these tomatoes here, and we've got these jugs which we're going to fill up with regular water and the Kangen water. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over here. First of all, fill up with regular tap water. And then the water is going to throw through the unit, and we're just going to get the Kangen water. So as we saw in our previous videos, the water from the unit has really helped reduce that oxidative stress so we're feeling more energized. It was high in alkalinity to help reduce acidic stress within the body. This is all about the microclustering, the hydration within. So let's just fill this one up. Okay, so let's take these back 
over here, put that there and that there. Now that I'm going to take the tomatoes because we want to get the tomatoes fresh from the unit with the cleaning water. So this one we're going to have as the tap water. So I'll fill this up. So we're going to give the tap water a head start. So I'll put that there so it's staying um, on that side of me. We're going to open this. Now we're going to choose the strong alkalized water. So this is the water that we use for cleaning our fruits and vegetables. We're just going to put it in there. Okay. Okay, so let's put tap water there and our strong kangen water here. So whilst they're sitting, we're actually going to show you the hydration test. So I've just got some green tea. I'm just going to pick two random tea bags out of here and put them in. Now then, can we make green tea with just regular cold water? Now, I've not experienced it before. I've always thought we needed to make it hot water. So what we're going to do is do this quick test. Now this is actually going to demonstrate whether we can make green tea with regular water. Um, oh, let's just open that up. And, and what's the, what this is going to actually show us is the micro clustering benefits of the water. So let's just help them out a little bit. Let's give them a little bit of a bounce. So the tea bags are getting soaked. And as you can clearly see straight away, the kangen water is made tea immediately. So let's move them over. Uh, I'll always give the tap water a bit of a head start. So you can see again straight away the kangen water is making the green tea. So what this is actually representing is the fact that when we're drinking this water it's actually going in and it's getting hydrated through breaking through the stomach lining and, um, and so on into the body so that the organs are getting hydrated. Now if our organs are, are hydrated effectively because they're mainly made up of water then our body can function properly. You can see straight away this, this is really making green tea very strongly. So what I'm going to do now before we get to the end I'm going to bring the tap water tea bag over and I'm going to bring the kangen water tea bag over. Same again tap water in first the kangen water in and look at how the kangen water same again as made tea immediately so this is pretty clear to see that how the kangen water actually is hydrating the body far far more quickly let's just put them into there bring that out of the way so we can see the difference there now then what we're going to do is just quickly give these tomatoes a little bit of a stir around just help them hey, I've got a few more tomatoes in here so we've given the tap water even more of a of a, of a head start I suppose we could say and then same here let's get these tomatoes around give them a little bit of a spin and then now then I think it's pr pretty clear to see what we've actually got here. This is the tap water, this is the strong kangen water. This is basically chemical residue from the tomatoes that we are ingesting on a regular basis that are helping create more toxic load within the body which leads to illness and disease. If we can help reduce that which is clearly shown by this water then we can clearly feel a lot better, feel a lot more energized and obviously enjoy life a lot better. So I hope you've enjoyed this, this presentation. Please reach out to us to learn more and we look forward to speaking to you soon. Thank you. Hi, people often say to me, Martin, water's just water. We know filtered water is better than tap water. But what makes your unit so special? Why is it the best on the market? Well, I'm going to explain to you exactly why, and I, why I believe it is the best and what it's done for me. So first of all, the unit connects to your tap and as soon as you turn the tap on you can have the water coming out the tap or it'll flow through the unit and be filtered. That's stage one. After that it goes through the process which is really the engine and the guts of the body that, that creates the different waters. So the first water we're going to talk about 
Stronger acidic water is actually used to help sanitize the home, um, around the office, whichever. So when you use it, I put it in a spray bottle, spray it around, and it will kill bacteria within 30 seconds. So it's very, very powerful. It's great if you've got young children, you've got grandchildren, to help reduce that chemical load from when you're cleaning. Um, the other thing that I like to do is put the 2.5 in a pump spray bottle and use it on my hands to help sanitize my hands so I'm not using chemical ridden creams and soaps and so on to help get rid of anything on my hands. What's produced at the same time is the 11.5. This is a degreasing water. So this is actually used for getting rid of pesticides, insecticides, herbicides off fruits and vegetables. So that when we're not ingesting all these chemicals that are on there. Because when we wash our fruits and vegetables in regular water, it doesn't remove anything. And if you refer to our other video, our microclustering video 3, this will give you clarity as to what comes off fruits and vegetables. It's quite shocking. So, beauty water is the next water we talk about. Now, this is actually used as a skin toner. It's an astringent, so it helps tighten up the pores. I like to put it in a little spray bottle and spray it on my skin. And this is why I look so damn sexy at 93. Can you believe it? 93. So, this water there is used on a daily basis. Then we've got clean water. Now, clean water is used to help... Um, you with form baby formula with pharmaceutical medication and the reason why we use it with the clean water it's basically filtered water that's structured in a normal way so that the uh, medication breaks down slowly and absorbed into the body as intended okay then we move on to the antioxidant rich waters so kangen water 8.5 is antioxidant rich which helps reduce the aging process and it's also alkaline, so that helps reduce acidic stress within the body. And once again, if you refer to the videos on oxidative stress and acidity on the website, video one and uh, two, you will see a clear demonstration as to the difference that this water makes. Now, this water can be used for hot drinks and, and cold drinks and so on. It's just a lower level of antioxidants. The next level up... 9.0 is a higher level of antioxidants. So it helps to reduce the aging process even more, as well as a higher level of alkalinity. So it's really good. Now, the difference between the two, obviously the 9 is higher. You would start on 8.5 in the beginning, so your body gets used to this level of antioxidants that it's consuming. And then you would move up to 9 probably the week after, so your body's used to it by then. 9.5 is optimal drinking level. This is the water that I drink, and I've been drinking for a number of years. This is really going to help the body get rid of that oxidative stress, get rid of the acidic stress to help the water be absorbed in to get rid of any toxins within the cells. And this is what this water is so good at, helping to detoxify your body. So you would start on level one, the Kangen 8.5, then you would move up to two, then you'd move up to three. And this is what's going to help reduce the aging process. Now, what I want to just do is show you how the unit filters the water through. So as I said, comes out the end of the tap, you turn this valve, the water goes through, filtered, charged, comes out here, and obviously you fill your glass up, turn the water off, and then take a drink. Absolutely amazing. Thank you very much. Take care. Hi, I'm often asked which is the best unit for me, as well as what are the differences between the units. First of all, let me explain the differences so that you can decide which unit is best for you. Now, are you concerned about uh, the aging process? Would you like to reduce it? Would you like to experience improved health and increased energy? Well, we start off with the Level Look R. This unit is designed to have antioxidant-rich water to help you reduce the aging process. It also has a water called Beauty Water, which is used for your skin as a skin toner. In addition to the Level Look R, we have the JR2. Now, would you like to reduce the chemicals that are on your fruits and vegetables before you eat them? Well, this unit produces a water that can eliminate those chemicals off your fruits and vegetables, as well as a water that's used for cleaning around the home. These waters are also in addition to the waters produced, which are high antioxidant rich water and the skin water. These two units together are basically like buying a handbag from Target. Okay? 
In addition to them, we've got the SD501. Now, this is the designer handbag from David Jones. This unit is medical grade technology and used throughout hospitals in Japan. It produces high levels of antioxidant rich water to reduce the aging process, the beauty water for your skincare, and also the cleaning waters for cleaning around the home and cleaning the fruits and vegetables. Now, the cleaning water on this one is actually used throughout hospitals to clean the instruments in Japan. It also has been shown to kill bacteria faster than bleach could kill it in under 30 seconds. So it's very, very powerful and very sexy. Then, in addition to the SD501, we have the latest technology, the Kangen 8. Now, this unit produces approximately 20% better quality water than its predecessor. It's upgraded technology, it has an LCD display, it can be used anywhere in the world, it is the bee's knees, and it's actually the unit that I own. So when we go over the, these four units, you can clearly see the difference to help you get clarity on which one unit's right for you, as well as the properties of the water being far greater and healthier the further we get along. Then we move on to the Inesper. Now, are you concerned about the water you and your family are bathing in with the chemicals that are in that water? The Inespa helps filter out those chemicals and also adds mineral ions for your skin and for your hair. This, or these, are two filters. Ten months of use by two people and a brand new filter. And you can clearly see the difference of what's been removed. Now as a package, I own the Inespa and the Kanganate so that I know that myself and my family are experiencing the best quality health properties available. This is the Enagic range. And if you would like to know more, please feel free to get in touch with me um, on the phone number on the website or via email. Thank you.